Jan and Chris, thank you so much for inviting me along to have a look at this amazing place. When did you discover this? It, it's incredible. Well, sadly, my uh, uncle Ron, Ron Gittins, died not so long ago in September. And uh, we always knew he was an artist and a very colourful character, but we had no idea he'd done all of this incredible stuff all over the ceilings and he made fireplaces. Uh, he was obsessed with the Romans and the Greeks and the Egyptians, so he's just kind of made this just <laughs> incredible environment. So but the interesting thing was we didn't discover it um, until after he was, uh, died because <coughs> he wouldn't let anybody in. So right, um, okay. it has really just come to light after his death. And I think that's the thing, you know, I, I've travelled all over the world to see um, outside of art environments like this uh -huh. and I never thought that I would come across this in <laughs> Birkenhead. So it's absolutely amazing. Um, so you're the caravan gallery, <coughs> what are you hoping to do now? What are you hoping is going to happen with, with Ron's flat now? Well, I, I, I've had so many sleepless nights thinking we can't let this place go. We don't want to paint of magnolia mm. and the uh, lion fireplaces. I mean, I'm obsessed with lions. <laughs> and that is just so spectacular, yeah. isn't it? And the thought of some builders coming in and just trashing it. Mm. Um, be doing. So the idea really now is that we've um, saved it um, as much as we can. It now needs restoring. Okay. So now, you, I mean, I think for my, to my mind, whenever we see um, outside of environments like this, you know, amazing places, one of the biggest threats to them is time. You know, that because mm. you've got landlords and you've got people who will want to be here and see it. So, yeah, yeah. Um, so the crowdfunding that you're launching, are you hoping that that's going to buy you some time to think about what you do with 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 Ron's villa, <laughs> as we've <laughs> been calling it? Exactly, um, because uh, well, we've made an agreement with um, the the owners who been absolutely amenable they've been brilliant souls free management services okay. and you know the flat has been empty for a few months while for the family and family friends have been rifling through things mm. and we just thought well uh, we've got to do what we can to yeah. hold on to it mm. so if <coughs> the idea of doing a crowdfunding campaign because you know it needs it needs to be made safe, mm. it needs to be made secure, mm. Mm. it needs cleaning up, it, we need mm. time to just go through everything. Uh, it could be made into a really useful uh, hub for the community, we can uh, we can use it for all sorts of events and social events, um, we can use it as a museum, a storage, uh, the sky's the limit. <laughs>